This is episode four of The McGee Files, where we keep learning more about Quincy University and what makes this place tick. In this episode, we'll be learning about the Student Success Center and the work done by our amazing success coaches. We'll be meeting Donna Holtmeyer, Director of Student Success. Let's go. I'm Brian McGee, President of Quincy University, and I am here with Donna Holtmeyer, who is Director of Student Success. Donna, have you ever had your president interview you in your own office? No, I have not. This is the first time. And are you excited or terrified? I am super excited. That is the right answer. So <laughs> we're so happy to be meeting with you. And if I understand correctly, several hundred students a semester sit in the chair I'm sitting in. Absolutely, they do, yes. Mm -hmm. Tell me, what is a success coach and do you wear a uniform? Sure. Yes, I wear my name tag as okay. a uniform. So we'll say that's my uniform. Um, and the success coaches position, we were established here at Quincy University to be a one-stop shop for our students. Obviously transitioning into college is a new chapter in mm -hmm. your life and so very different. So the success coach's responsibility is to get to know the students, help them in whatever way possible, including academically so they can be successful, as well as in their personal life and growing and maturing. Mm -hmm. So if a student comes and says, well, you know, I'm used to getting better grades, but I don't want to study. What should I do? We talk about that. We talk about <laughs> how in college, the professors don't give you stuff to regurgitate back. You actually have to do some research and some studying on your own. So your official position is that you will have to study if you want to succeed. In yes, that is the official position. All right. So sometimes you talk to people about how to study. Absolutely. We like, give them study tips. A lot mm -hmm. of what we do is also time management. Mm -hmm. um, the students now have their 24 hours all by themselves with no moms or dads or anybody managing them. So mm -hmm. we help them look at how to manage their time as well as um, those study tips and test taking ideas. So all, all studying, for example, should happen between 1 a.m. and 4 a.m.? No, okay. um, we look at it as eight to five. The college is your job. So mm -hmm. between eight and five, you're either going to class or you're studying. Mm -hmm. If you do that, 90% of your work is done already and then you, don't, you get your evenings for yourself. Okay, well, but I mean, college is easy. You just got a couple of <laughs> classes to go to. You read for a few minutes, and then you can just party with your friends. Is that the way it works? Um, not quite. That is okay. not the way it works. It's not like on TV. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so I shouldn't watch. Uh, I shouldn't watch TV to learn what college life is like. Absolutely not. Yeah. No. Okay. Now, uh, now here's a good question: Are the professors meaner than the professors on TV? No, especially here at Quincy University, our professors love their students. They work extra hours to help them be successful. Um, and if you're in their major, then they might be your academic advisor. So developing that relationship with them is really great. Um, I love working with our professors and um, you can just see how much they're devoted to the students. Okay, well Donna, I'm now confused because you said sometimes the faculty member is an academic advisor, sometimes they're talking to you as a success coach. What's the difference between an advisor and a coach? Sure. Other than the uniform. <laughs> well, um, your academic advisor is mm -hmm. going to um, work with you on your long range plans. Mm -hmm. What are you interested in doing? What, what, what do you want your degree to do? Where do you want it to take you? Um, and the classes to get there. As your success coach, we're gonna make sure that all of the detailed stuff happens so that you are successful. Mm -hmm. So we are gonna help your success by design in making sure that um, everything stays on track. Okay. Um, and by everything stays on track, you mean finishing a reasonable number of classes, have good grades. Yes. Um, remember to eat some good and nutritious food, yes. sleep regularly, and graduate on time? Absolutely. That's exactly it. We want that balance mm -hmm. because it should be a, college should be a great experience okay. for you. Now, you said balance. So uh, is this candy this year part of the balanced and healthy diet you recommend? It is absolutely part of the balance because it's reward. It's important mm -hmm. to get a reward every now and again. <laughs> and sometimes you need that sugar boost to get through a test or okay. something like that. So the candy dish is always full. All right. So do college presidents get some candy? Absolutely. <laughs> Help yourself. And that's what I tell our students as well. <laughs> what else should a student know for a meeting with you? Should the student come with uh, a plan or some ideas about what to ask? Can they come in and say, I don't have a clue what I'm doing wrong. You tell me. Tell me if I'm doing anything right. Just tell me to keep on doing on. Right. What goes on? They can come with either any questions or no questions. Mm -hmm. So as success coaches, we've done everything here at Quincy University. Mm -hmm. I've helped 
fix glasses. I've gotten a tooth pulled before. Um, you personally pulled the tooth? <laughs> not personally. Okay, but I, we've I was helped say, them. I don't see a dental degree on, on the <laughs> no, wall No, 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 no. We, um, we helped arrange that. Because you know your dentist may be five hours away. So mm. what do you do if you break off a tooth? Or you were playing Frisbee and got hit and broke your glasses. Mm. You're not used to taking care of those things. Okay. So we do those things as well. So, so you can come in and tell me those. You can come in and tell me you're very sad and you miss home and we talk about that. You can tell me that you have no idea who you want to be when you grow up, and we can talk about that too. So we really cover the whole scope. We really are that one-stop shop like okay. I talked about. So what else should I know about the Student Success Center at Quincy University and Success by Design, Donna? Well, you should know that the Success Center was built primarily and only for our students. Mm -hmm. um, the university saw the need, we got the grant, and we were happy to make the space for the students. It's open to them 24 hours mm -hmm. a day, so they can come and study if they're night owls, like you talked about the one to four. Some are night owls, they can do that, or early in the morning. So um, also you can get tutoring services through here. Our tutoring service is a wonderful experience. It's our students that have already taken those classes, done extremely well in them, been recommended by their professor. And then we at the university pay them to work with other mm -hmm. students, either to help them understand the material better or to get prepared for a paper, review a paper, um, understand concepts in the class. So we do all of those sort of things um, with our student tutors. We also have SIs, which are supplemental instructors. Mm -hmm. They are really neat. They actually sit in the class with you, also have taken the class and been recommended by the professor, and then they go over the material again. Some of our classes do a lot of learning mm -hmm. in a very short period of time. So the SIs go over that material with them in our dip more difficult classes to help them understand. So it's a set time. You come every week and you get more um, information and more in-depth stuff about the class that you're learning about. So in summary, if I walk in here this fall as a new student, I'll have access to supplemental instructors, success coaches, and I'll have tutors as well if I need help in any particular subject. Absolutely. So every single student who comes to QU should succeed. Absolutely. All right. Well, that sounds like we've designed a pretty good plan for student success. And you say this not only as a success coach, but over your left shoulder, I see there's a diploma from QU. Absolutely. I am a proud alumni of Quincy University. Out outstanding. And I would just have to say it has been a pleasure visiting with you, Donna. Please keep me well supplied and candy going forward, and I'll be a happy president. And this has been episode four of The McGee Files.